Good morning, family and friends. This is your girl, Charlene, coming back with another video to encourage you, to inspire you, to live your best life. It's a beautiful day. The sun is shining. God gave me another day, and I'm grateful for it, and I'm going to tell somebody how good he is and how blessed we are to be living in America and how blessed we are to be able to worship our God. Because in some countries, you can't worship the Lord. You can't go to church. And you can't even say the word Jesus. So I thank the Lord that I have the ability. Excuse me, I got a little vitamins in my mouth. I'm sorry. But I thank the Lord for having the opportunities that I have here in America. I'm grateful that he continues to use me to tell somebody how good he is. And what I want to tell y'all today, don't give up on your dreams. I know that sometimes life is hard. I know you go through trials and tribulations. But if God put a dream in your heart, don't you let go of that dream. You keep fighting. You keep trying. You keep working towards your dreams. God has something special just for you. He has a plan. He has a purpose. And if he put that dream inside of you, don't you let that dream die. You better get up. You better fight. I don't care what it takes. I don't care what you have to go through. God is with you. If he gave you that dream on your heart, he will see you through it. But you have to quit holding you back. Nobody in this world can hold you back but you. If you have God on your side, who can be against you? We can be our worst enemy. We are usually the ones who's holding us back. We love to blame everybody. We love to think it's everybody else that's holding us back. But a lot of times it's us. It's our fear. It's our worry. It's the lies of the devil that stop us from getting everything that God has for us and want us to have. So I don't care if you're 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, or 90. Don't you give up on your dreams. If you have breath in your body, if you woke up in your right mind with use of your limbs, then you get to fighting. It ain't over. God has something just for you, and he wants to make those dreams come to pass. God loves you, and he don't want to see you suffer. He don't like you going through all that you're going through, but you got to get up. You got to trust God. You got to put one foot in front of the other. You can't continue to listen to the haters. I know it's rough sometimes, but you're tough. You can do it. I'm trying my best to walk out my dreams. I'm trying my best not to give in, and you got to do the same thing. I don't care what happens to you in life. If God is on your side, it will work out. So get up, get moving, have... um expecting heart today that God is going to do something great for you and don't you just keep walking around mad and being in misery God loves you he gave his son to die for you so you got to get up you got to take a hold of what God has already done for you and you got to expect what's coming your way don't just lay there. Don't just fall for all the tricks and the lies of the devil. You get up. You get moving. You get fighting. You keep praying. You keep trying. You keep thanking the Lord. And I promise you, it will work out. It may not work out how you want it to do or how you want it to or when you want it to. But I promise you, God is going to work it out for your good. So you get up. You have a blessed day. You spend some time with God. You ask God for his help and his strength. And I promise you, God will be faithful to help you wherever you are. I'm a living testimony that God 
answers prayers. Prayers changes something. I'm walking out my dream right now. I'm living here in beautiful, sunny California. I'm not exactly where I want to be, but I'm grateful and I'm thankful for the journey that God has put me on. So y'all get up, get moving. It's Friday. It's payday. Woo, woo, woo. That always makes Friday better. Even though I got a bunch of bills, it'll be gone by Monday. I'm grateful today that I have a job. I have a paycheck. This is Memorial Weekend. I got four days off because I took Tuesday off too. I'm enjoying myself. I'm going to do something for me. So you enjoy yourself. Do something for you. And be safe out here in these streets. It's probably going to be warm. And you know when it's warm, the crazy folks come out. So you enjoy your weekend, but use the brain that the Lord gave you. Don't get caught up in a bunch of foolishness and a bunch of hating and just have a blessed weekend because this is the day that the Lord has made. So remember, do your best, pray about the rest. Subscribe to my YouTube channel at Charlene Sparks. Follow me on Instagram at one Charlene Sparks. And y'all have a blessed Memorial Weekend holiday. Don't let nobody steal your joy. Be safe in these streets and just enjoy your day. All right, I love you and God loves you and just make the best of this opportunity that God has given you. In whose name? In Jesus' name. In whose name? In Jesus' name. All right, enjoy your day. I will. Love you. Mwah.